Yes, it is flu season, but that's not the only thing to worry about. It is also the time of year we start to see more and more stomach illnesses, and that is why doctors are reminding you, please wash your hands. But what you use to wash them may not be enough to kill the virus. 13 on your side, Sarah Makuda verifies how to prevent these illnesses from spreading. Let's talk about washing your hands with soap and water versus using hand sanitizer. They're equally effective at keeping you healthy this flu season, aren't they? Not quite. According to the CDC, alcohol-based sanitizer can kill some germs, like cold and flu viruses, when it's used correctly. But it has no fight against other germs, including norovirus, which is the common and very contagious stomach bug. Soap and water is more effective at getting rid of that than, than hand sanitizer. A lot of it has to do with the way that people are using it. Sometimes what you're doing is you have norovirus on your hands, you're simply spreading it around. But getting the flu shot prevents all forms of the flu, right? That's false. That's, well, it's effective against preventing the flu, but, you know, the thing about flu is that it's, it's sneaky, like it changes a lot, and there's different viruses that are circulating, and it causes body aches and fevers and cough and headache and things like that. Vomiting diarrhea, while influenza can cause that, it's not as common and more likely you have norovirus. Okay, so the flu vaccine doesn't immunize you to the norovirus, and it's false to believe that using hand sanitizer has the same preventative game as washing your hands with soap and warm water, which experts agree is the best practice to stay on your feet this flu season. And if you absolutely can't get to a sink, use a hand sanitizer, but make sure it has at least 60% alcohol. For your Verify, I'm Sarah Makuda.